Welcome, welcome back to another re everything video. Today's not a dislike video. Today I'm taking a break from dislike because I'm preparing for the event. Uh, that comes in two days. Uh, I'm gonna do a Luca showcase tomorrow. Um, and probably release it uh, sometime tomorrow. But today I kind of wanted to go over some things I'm very excited for. Uh, some games that I've been looking forward to uh, that are coming to mobile. Um, I am a mobile gamer slash PC gamer, and some of these are even coming on PC as well, right? And I wanted to go over what I'm excited for, what I'm going to play this month, all right? Uh, apart from other things that I'm going to play on consoles, I'm not going to go over those today, all right? So first, we have the lovely tower of fantasy um this game has its ups and downs i'm not gonna play the music because i don't want to get copyrighted but um i saw some gameplay i've seen this trailer um it looks very good i i anticipate it a lot i'm very very hyped for it uh mostly because of the combat and it, it does remind me of genshin it gives me that little spark of hope that i have some content that i have that i have something that's similar to Genshin that I can enjoy. Um, and, and apparently this is an MMO as well. So, and, and I'm a talker for MMO. I play Guild Wars 2. I play um, Wizard 101. I play a bunch of them. That's right. Uh, so looking, looking at this gameplay, it's looking really, really promising. Um, this is one of the first trailers, so it's still a little scuffed, but it looks really nice. It's it's one of these games where I'm like, well, it's a blatant copy or copy of Genshin, but at the same time, it looks good on its own, right? And, and that gives me hope. Maybe the developers do better <laughs> with less of a budget, obviously, right? It, it really excites me to just think that I have a story and a game to look forward to. Uh, apart from Xenoblade Chronicles 3, baby! Hi, yo! But, uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna get into that, because I'll be here for hours. Uh, yeah, I mean, the trailer looks amazing. Uh, the story looks like it's gonna be riveting, looks like it's gonna be different. Uh, and it's launching, um, in the second half of 2022, which is in the summer, which is now, around, around this time, maybe August, uh, they're gonna launch, and it's gonna be free to play, completely free, you don't have to pay anything, um, and you can enjoy the game. Uh, I think what they're doing to monetize it uh, is in-game pulls for probably cosmetics. I'm not completely sure yet. They haven't made it completely clear. Uh, the next thing I'm excited for is Full Metal Alchemist. Listen, for those who don't know me, I am a big weeb. I, I play a lot or, or, or watch a lot of anime. I just finished watching Spike's Family the other day. Um, and Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood is my favorite anime of all time. Uh, and it getting a mobile game that is very Fire Emblem-esque makes me really happy. Because I did love Fire Emblem Three Houses, I've played Fire Emblem games before, and having that gameplay, but with Full Metal Alchemist characters, it makes me feel right at home. I think I'm gonna really, really, really enjoy this game. This, this game is gonna be fantastic for me. Um, I'll be playing it day one. I'll be making content on it as well as I'll be making content on Tower Fantasy. I'll be making content on games that I enjoy. That, that is the point of this channel. It's not to play only Dislike, right? Right now it's Dislike because Dislike's one of the only games I play right now. Um, but in the future, look forward to seeing more games, to seeing more games. I even tried Nino Kuni, but it was a uh, heck. <laughs> um, so hopefully th these games don't turn out the same. And it doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like it. Uh, as you can see, uh, combat like this, uh, you go up to that, uh, like that, like Fire Emblem strategy, and then you actually zoom in to a fight, right? It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I like it a lot. Um, I think it's gonna be very unique. It's coming to global as well. Don't mind that this is Japanese. Uh, I am very excited for Full Metal Alchemist. And I hope you'll join me in that excitement because I, I'm going to be playing it on this channel. And if you think you don't know yet, either you're indecisive, make sure to tune in because I'll be making content. Anyway, next and final one that I'm going to cover for today is Black Clover. Actually, let, let, let's finish this first. Let's finish this first. It's looking really good. Uh, the old animations look 
sexy. I'm so, I'm so hype. I'm so hype. Um, yeah, there you go. It, lo it looks sick. It looks sick. But the next one's Black Clover, and I am a big Black Clover fan. Um, it is on hiatus right now. I read the manga. Uh, so far it looks so sick, and hopefully this mobile game can stay the same. <laughs> Cause I'm a little scared to be honest. Uh, Black Clover has two games. The mobile game that that is out right now, which is like a 2D, think of Epic Seven, uh, kind of like that. But it, it was not good. It was not good. As much time as I wanted to give it, it was not good. And then they released the console game, which was pretty all right, but it had a lot of flaws and it was PvP. Um, and this is going to consist of PvE and PvP. It's going to be open area, not open world, open area. So you, you can go into separate areas, walk around those areas, talk to characters. Uh, there's the goat, Yami. Uh, it's looking good as far as graphics so far, and it looks like it's gonna cover the story one-to-one -one, uh, when it comes to the anime uh, As you can see on, on this on, on this trailer, it's basically covering like the first arc of the anime um, And what I'm excited for honestly just thinking about this is maybe like they, they haven't shown a lot of the combat like you can pull characters and all that stuff uh, It is a gacha game and There's the open world that I was talking about I'm hoping that you can play with friends uh, and that you can like do, you know, friend raids and stuff for relics, like, like kind of like Genshin, right? But I'm hoping there's like boss raids and shit. I, I feel like, I feel like it would be really, 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 really cool. Create your own team using the most powerful mages. Um, I'm, I'm very, very excited, especially for like Julius, especially for Yami. Uh, I'm, I'm super excited. I hope they cover, uh, arcs past the beginning or first half of black clover because if they do fire <laughs> and uh i hope that they don't do a malicious like currency system kind of like seven deadly sins <laughs> um but to be fair seven deadly sins have gotten better is given more more uh in-game currency and i hope they do the same here I hope they do the same here, and I hope there's a lot of depth that you can put into your team building. Um, honestly, those are the games that I'm super hyped for right now, but this might change. I might make another video in three weeks describing the other games that I'm super hyped for. Um, we can finish up this trailer real quick, and then I will show you one game that I'm not going to cover, but I will just show you it uh that i'm definitely playing <laughs> i'm definitely playing because i've played these games yeah this this animation looks so sick man take on bigger full battles with mystical mages i'm super i'm super excited for this yeah yeah this, this is gonna be sick this is gonna be absolutely sick yeah this this gave me hope this gave me hope that there's gonna be like raid bosses that you can take on with your like friends all right because uh, you all know Black Clover is all about like friendship and and uh, being part of a guild, right? Um, so that's what I'm hoping to see here, right? You can play with friends, you can do raids with friends, you can do you can have fun with friends, right? <laughs> and it looks it looks good. Uh, and the last thing I'm going to say is this game right here, Xenoblade Three. Xenoblade 3 is my most anticipated game of the year. <laughs> I love Xenoblade 3. I am a fiend for Xenoblade. Um, but yeah, those, those are the games that I am very excited for. Let me know if any of them interested you. And if not, let me know if you have any in mind that you're excited for. Um, with that being said, it's been Re-Everything and I am out.